Denver. Easy going world. Welcome back to Nomadius. The name I chose is Thaddeus. I'm here. Rio Sierpe. Rio Sierpe River Camp. I'm just gonna go on a little journey and ask some questions. So come on. Let's see what awaits us. Almost peace and quiet, but nature has its beautiful sounds. This place is incredible. And I'm really feeling grounded through the humidity, through the bug bites, through the adjustments. It's been very easy for me to come back to my heart, my soul, and my spirit. And I got some questions I, read, I wrote down that I'd like to share with you guys just to give you guys a window into my mind and spirit today. As I ground myself and realize that everything around me is alive, breathing, and giving me the life that my spirit lives within, I ask nature and I ask this space, what wisdom comes forth to me here? Or shall I say, what wisdom comes forth to I and I here? What innate abilities are human beings born with? Why am I and I here? What led I and I here? What's I and I's purpose here? Why do we forget that nature is alive? How does I and I's melanin connect I and I? nature what would nature like to teach I and I and what are we yet to understand about nature One thing that's always stuck with me is when we say man-made, it's a way for us to remove ourselves from nature without realizing that we are nature in everything that we do. A beetle doesn't create at any point and does it become beetle-made and just because it's beetle-made, does it remove it from nature? Nature made it, the tree made it, the bird made it, the human being made it. So I subscribe to what we create is nature. Now, how did we go about creating? Maybe it wasn't so natural in the sense that it's maybe not a process that's found within this nature, but that doesn't mean that it's not nature. So it's time we enlighten ourselves and remember that man-made is nature-made. A woman gives birth to a child. That's woman made. That's nature made. That's made by 
nature. Pause this video and comment below what you think about the concept of man-made being nature. Feel free to voice your own opinion. This is open for discussion because we're all a part of nature. So we're all trying to understand our place within, within this world, within this natural world. And that people, elites, people who have control of resources tell us that we're losing our natural world. But if you ask me, I believe we are beyond abundant. So, from my earlier moments of asking questions, moved to a different spot that's brought forth some other wisdom and some other questions that my mind is open to and looking for answers. Sometimes not even just looking for answers. We just have the ability to ask questions. Why? Are there three states of matter? Solid, liquid, gas. And within us, we have solid, liquid, gas. Is light a state of matter? Pure light. If not, what is light? Why did we choose to be human beings? Does nature have good and evil energy? If no other species dominates the world, then why do we human beings feel the need to? Do parts of nature study our human nature? Do trees feel, let me ask the trees. Do you feel a sense of home? I think they said they'll get back to me. At least that's what I felt. And my last question for the moment, for the plants and trees, do you trees and plants have parents? They told me yes. Who are your parents? What comes to me is us. One more question. Who is us? you and me so i and i i 
I understand. I overstand. And I understand. This place is full of beautiful things and I'm living life to the fullest here. So I just want to close this video off with saying here at Siete River in Costa Rica, the nature is speaking to me because I'm a part of nature. You're a part of nature. So tune into yourself and nature will tune into you. Tune into yourself and nature will tune into you because that's what nature is about. Tuning in to finding its place on this planet we call Earth or as some of us call Gaia or as I like to call Yene Island. So let's remember y'all, sun is still shining, the wind is still blowing, the water is still flowing, and we are still rising. Nomadius.